So how do we know all of the commands that are available in Java? That would be a pretty tough thing to know. First of all, there's as many stars in the sky as there are commands in Java. So to help us keep track of all of this, we have a library that we can use. Now, when you walk into a library, do you know all of the books that are in there right away the minute you walk in? Probably not. It would be pretty amazing if any one person did. I don't think anyone expects anyone to know all of the Java commands that are available, or even close to it. But there's a great receptacle like a library where we can find those. And I'd like to show you that now. These work like folders, and there's programs in all of them. Even if you Google <coughs> Java API um, or something like that, Java class API, you should get to this site that looks something like this. It is extremely overwhelming. And if you look on the left side, you will see a list of the many, many gajillions of Java classes that are available. So far, we've used Scanner and JOption Pane. They're listed in here, believe it or not. But again, we're looking at the number of stars in the sky. So we could sit here and scroll through this all day. We'll go through a few of these. But just know that there are many, many things to choose from. And this list is changing every day. Believe it or not, when I first started using Java, there were about five classes to choose from. And now there's like five zillion. <laughs> so hopefully, um, you'll find some time to just go sort of scrolling through that and seeing what looks interesting to you. For this class, we're going to start with using the scanner and the J option pane classes. But when we do, I just want you to know this is where I went to find those. Mm -hmm.